are back here at the Ryan Center, and we welcome you to our halftime report sponsored by the Ramzo. And at the break, it's all Rhode Island on top of their rivals from UMass, 46-29 at halftime. Lamont Homer, Keith Cothran, Delroy James. We take a look at a unique relationship between these three teammates and three friends on and off the court. Omer. He gets mad when I call him Lamonte. We call him his full name, so I call him Air, Air. Oh, he called me Airline. I call Monty Airline. We just call it Del, Del. You know, actually, Delroy committed before both of us. I seen that he committed, and that's when I committed. And Lamont, he didn't really know where he wanted to go. I mean, I used to see him all the time. He just say, yeah, you're going to Rhode Island, no matter what. Like, you're going to Rhode Island. And he was just like, all right, let's go. We got in here together. We lived in the same dorm. We lived very close to each other all our lives. And me and Beef, Keith, extra. You hear me saying Beef, Keith, Beef. The coach even called him Beefy. Yeah, Lamont played on the same day. Team. When you he hear the coach, beefy, beefy, you like, huh? We played in camps. Keith was in my all-star team in a camp. The Delray. Actually, I met him in prep school. He's real enthusiastic. So he was crazy because the first time I saw him, he likes to yell and scream. He was yelling on the court, and that was my first impression. I was like, dang, he's crazy. Why is he so loud? Pump his chest and get the crowd involved and get his teammates involved. It's just the free spirit nature we have. They had just scored, or he just scored. And he just turned around and just started yelling, like, ah! Just looked at you like, yo, come on. Come on, let's work! And then <laughs> I was like, all right. <laughs> let's say I'm out the game. Lamont keeps in the game, like, beef, come on, let's go. Give me some now. Lamont, get, let me get a rebound. But that was the first time I met Dell. And then when we got here, then that's when all three of us started hanging out freshman year. That's when we got close. We just we were real close, and it showed on the court and off. And that's the people that you want to be around, knowing they have your back. People you could um, rely on and trust. You know, days that we don't want to get in the gym. I'm like the personal alarm clock. One of the three is going to make sure we're in the gym together. You see when we have to lift in the morning at 6 a.m., and I just bang on their doors. We're going to make sure we get up and go to class. We're going to make sure everything is on time. We're all on time for everything. We're going to push each other. We walk around campus. Everybody knows. If they see one of us, they know the other one, the other two is following behind somewhere. Just look at us, oh, look at those three. All of us are goofy. Lamont, he's just probably the most backwards, funny guy you know. Everything he does just seems backwards. He sat here just now with his jersey backwards. A lot of people like to listen to songs that get them pumped up and rowdy, but Lamont's always listening to slow songs before the game. Basketball is like a full-time job to us. If we're not playing basketball, we're all three of us together all the time. We love competing against each other, so we always go bowling and see if we can. Yeah, he's not good, though. We're good. I hope you said he wasn't good. Yeah, we think we're the best players. The best. It's not good. We also have fun in everything we do. Delroy, he been been watching chick flicks. Most of his collection. <laughs> he loves chick flicks. My collection movies more real, you know, alternate to the like soft side, as you might say. Any chick flick you can name. The Holiday, Serendipity. I was watching before I got here today. It's alright. It ain't that he bad. Talked <laughs> about my soft side, but. On nights, he just, he's not, yo, let me get one of those movies, and he comes get it. There's so many memories, I can't even. We already had a strong bar before basketball, so we just already naturally close to each other. Grows as more of like a brotherhood. I love them guys, and I love everything that, that we've been through. Being true to yourself and being true with them. You know, right now, it's, it's starting to show on the court. On the court, off the court. It's a plus to have them guys and be able to be brothers with them guys. Well, we know how good they are on the court. Who knew that Delroy James was a softy for chick flicks? Now we know everything. It is halftime here at the Ryan Center. 46-29, Rams on top. We'll continue along with our halftime report after this.